what is up guys it is now friday i'm sorry i didn't vlog yesterday i was up at 4 a.m i got back at one and then i had some food worked out i'm applying for jobs because i'm relocating at the moment so i had lots of applications and interviews and all that jazz and there wasn't really too much worth vlogging i do want to vlog the gym again but like recently the gym i'm going to is like so busy that i just i keep going on like peak hour normally i go really really late but recently i've been going like peak hour so it's like so busy and i don't want to be that person that's like got the camera out and all of that jazz it's now friday so i still have my hair from yesterday i can't bring myself to take out the braid like i think it's so cute i'm gonna have to wash it tonight but I just don't want to, it's so cute. But I have quite a busy day today. I need to go and take all of my stuff to see yet because I have like so much old stuff that I've held onto for so long, but I'm really never gonna play it again. So I'm just getting rid of like all the stuff I don't want. I'm keeping my Animal Crossings, which I played last night just to kind of go through them. And that was a trip. I was actually a lunatic when I was younger. I'm not sure too much has changed, but that was actually really fun to go back and kind of play through those. I'm taking like literally all of my stuff to CX. I don't want to take it with me when I move. And they had this thing now, basically fill in like an order form online. So when you get there, you just leave it with them and then you know what I mean? Like you don't have to sit there in the shop and go through it all, which is really cool. I have to take my clothes to the clothes bank. I have to pack. All of my boxes finally came. This room is just full of my old stuff slash stuff I'm kind of keeping. So I really do need to pack today because I don't have too many days. We're moving on the 21st. I have a shoot on the 20th. I have some interviews next week for jobs. Dan's obviously working. We're resting all weekend. So today is really like the last day to make things happen i think there's some time next week oh and i wanted to get my vaccine today i forgot about that there's like a walk-in center so if i can i want to get my vaccine because i can't really see a better day is in getting free time to go and do it so yeah we've got cx clothes bank vaccine and packing and gym not too much on at all it's the midday but before we jump into that i actually have so many packages as you can probably tell fingers crossed i haven't doxed myself well I don't live here anymore. So I thought I would go ahead and open them for you guys just while we're on vlog because I never have this many packages. This is insane. I've hardly been home all week. So they've just racked up and it's a mixture of some stuff for the Halloween costume I'm doing. To be honest, I'm going to tell you guys because I feel like by the time this vlog goes up, I'll have done it or it's too close to the day for anyone to try to copy me. I mean, they probably still will, but whatever. Like, I know it's ambitious because I've got so much on right now. I'm moving, I'm filming, I've got my job, I'm applying for jobs and all that jazz. But I really wanted to do something creative. So I'm gonna do Mariah May as Harley Quinn. So it's all in my colors. Like I've got stuff specially made slash I am making stuff. So it's all gonna be baby pink and black and white because those are my colors. It's gonna have all eyes on me on the tee because that's my quote. I'm gonna do like the half and half makeup and hair but obviously in pink and black. I shoot and filming stuff for it. So is it really ambitious? Yes but I'm very much looking forward to it. I really wanted to like, because I'm wrestling in it, I wanted it to be Mariah May the Glamour. So I wanted it to be my take on something rather than just like dressing up as like the devil. So I really wanted it to still be the, the glamour and still be me. And that's what I'm doing. Obviously they will be on my store, which is mariahmay.bigcartel.com. I'll be doing eight by tens and all that good stuff. I'm gonna be making some video packages and some really cool things. But that is kind of what a lot of this stuff is. But then we also have some random bits and pieces. So obviously like, I have been getting up at I think like 4am and I really wanted like a coffee flask, is that what they're called? And I was going to buy one in the shops for like 8 quid and then I was just, well actually no, they're way more than that. But there was none that I loved. Danny was like, why don't you get one custom made? So this is my logo, which is by Over by Design, who pretty much does like all of my graphics, apart from my really old thumbnails, they were me and I'm sorry. It has Mariah made the glamour on it. And this is actually really good quality. This is from Snapfish, which I've never got stuff from before. This is like amazing quality and then it just has this on it. So when I go early in the morning for jobs and stuff, this is gonna be really cool because normally I'm like, like drinking this boiling hot coffee. <laughs> like the other day I was so tired and I just, I honestly debated getting a spoonful of coffee and just like eating it. That's why I debated. Oh, this is cool. So then it has like this and you just flick it up. And then I guess, oh my gosh, there's so much, there's a lot going on, but this is really good quality. So I'm very impressed and it's, the glamour on brands love that okay so the next thing is i think the baseball bat i'm gonna take a wild guess by the shape honestly who has given me a bat like who's given me a weapon is what i want to know so i just went for black but it's more for like just 
the design. Right, Maze, Holly Quinn. Amazon parcel right now. Okay, cool. So then these are the black fishnet. Yeah, I'm really excited. Like, I love like creating new wrestling gear. I love designing gear. I'm actually learning to sew, uh, which I will be vlogging and all of that good stuff, don't worry. But like, I just love creating new things. So to be able to kind of play this like darker side to myself, I'm so excited. Oh my Lord. Okay. Woo. So I have all of these hairbands. Obviously I think I'm gonna be using the top two. Maybe this one, but probably the top two. The problem is sometimes with baby pink, it doesn't show off as much. Like for example, like nail varnish, which by the way, how cute is my like gold nail varnish? Which actually matches the set of gear that I have part of the secret project, but you guys can't see yet. But I find sometimes baby pink doesn't show off as well. Like say for example, nail varnish, so you have to go for more of a middle pink. I think this will work though. And then it's quite cool that I have all of these spares because it means in future when I do different stuff with the gear, like I love doing stuff with my hair, even though this wasn't me. <laughs> But I do love doing stuff with my hair, so it's really cool to just have this kind of stuff to get creative with. And then we have face gems. I'm gonna have to like dip into my Liv Morgan bag. I've had like face gems favorited for a while in my basket. Like when I was doing my shoot over lockdown with all my new gear, I um denied about it. And then I just, I guess I didn't go for it just because I was doing four sets in one day. And I kind of kept like the same makeup. Whereas like this is just specifically one gear. And I do think it would be cool to dip and dive into them. Obviously with wrestling, like I don't feel they'll stay on. But with a shoot, you really have that luxury to kind of like add in things that you can't maybe wrestle in. So I do want to wear these. I'm not sure how I'm going to glue them on. I don't know if they're self-adhesive or like they say body gems. I might get a little glue or something from Superdrug or I could use eyelash glue, I'm not sure yet. But I do have this mixture of gems and it looks like there's like quite a few different ones in there. I can see love hearts, which is really cool. Next, I have hair chalk, which I'm probably most nervous about. It's got like a gray black color. Like I don't know how well the black is gonna work. I'm thinking if the black looks like atrocious, I'm gonna go pink and pink. I think that would like I could get away with that and then maybe just do like black bows for hair bands. Obviously I would love for the black to work so it's like half and half, but I'm prepared to do that. That's like my solution because I don't know like if you really get black chalk, if that makes sense. Okay. Amazon parcel 506. <laughs> okay, yeah. So next up I just have the nail varnish because I want to do like one pink, one black, one pink, one black. I know, like, why do I do it to myself? Why have I created this amount of work and detail? But if, when it's me, like, I can't half ass anything. Like, I have to go so over the top. Like, I could just do, I could just wear this for the show, but no, I've got to do a shoot. I've got to do eight by tens. I've got to do video packages. I've got to do like all this extra stuff with it. But I just, I love it. Like, I love being creative. So I'm like a victim of myself, if that makes sense. But I love it, it's fine. Also, yes, I need to order a bed today. That's that's a big one. I'm like, I've got a baseball bat. And it's like, have you got a bed? And then obviously I just got black as well. I think that's it for Amazon. Yeah, that's it for Amazon. So we can get into like some more. Oh, what is that? That's so heavy. Oh my God. Okay, so we have, I saw it first with a million brochures like a million and one. So what is this? What the hell is this? I don't, I don't even know what's going on. I don't even remember. Oh my God. So I saw it first, have the Mean Girls collection and I've gotten a few bits from there before if you've watched my other vlogs. I think I got like one of the teas and the scrunchies. <gasps> Look at this. So this is gonna be so cute for the new apartment. I absolutely love that. I'm a mouse, duh. So good, so excited about that. And then I also just got the phone case that says fetch. These, I'm so excited. So it's like a pair of pajamas, but well, I feel like I love loungewear. Like I'm obsessed with loungewear, obsessed with pajamas. So I always want them to look cute and put together, but I kind of would wear this tee like just in real life. But it's like a little bit dramatic is the top and it says gorgeous baby pink, which give me everything you know I love it and then it just has the leggings that just have like the kisses and the mean girls on it which are just so cute and they're so soft and then finally we're moving on to Opoly this little like red top which I feel like with Opoly their tops just get 
smaller and smaller like i can't eat bread for a week before i wear this but how amazing is this with like a red lip this is gonna be so cute and then i loved it so much <laughs> that i got it in black <laughs> which i just think is so hot like i think it's amazing i've got like body suits and things like that that i'm not 100 percent sure if they're going to be transparent and stuff so that's why i got this just so i could put it over the top or underneath um just to kind of troubleshoot that and then i'm not gonna get time to do it this year like i have an angel dress and i have angel wings and i never like i wore them when i was younger i think i went to like a halloween thing and i have i still have the wings they're gorgeous and I've always wanted to do like an angel, but I've never done it. I don't think I have time to add in an angel. However, can we take a moment for this? I love that it's shiny. It's so gorgeous. I mean, to be fair, like again, obviously it's kind of intended for Halloween, but I feel like you could just wear this whenever. It's just a white corset. And this one's cool because it's actually a top, not just like a bra. And then I have one more and I don't know what it is. And the scariest part is like, I'm still expecting more packages. So these are matching black shorts for the black bra. Now I've always wanted a pair of shorts like this. And then it's really cool because it's exactly what I needed for the costume. So again, it's just a bit of a like two birds, one stone or just an excuse for me to really just go shopping. But I love these and they actually look like they're gonna be really stretchy too. So I looked at them on the model who's like an amazing hourglass and I was like, I just don't know if it's gonna fit me or how it's gonna fit, but they look super stretchy. So they're really, really cool. I actually wanna get wrestling gear like that. I think that would be really cool. But yeah, I think, I think that covers like all of the packages for us. So I am gonna get a move on. I need to go to CX, I need to go to the clothes bank. I wanna get my vaccine if I can. I need to get my second one. And then I'm gonna pack and gym and then we've got shows all weekend. It's going so well. <laughs> But yeah, let's head on. So we are off to get my second vaccine. Oh, I'm breaking them. <laughs> I'm scared. I don't like needles. I had my first one. My mother had to literally come and take me out of the centre because I felt faint. But also guys, how cute is the outfit? I can't really even show you remotely. Are you excited Dan? Easy to get back soon. Mm. my own double jabs. Oh my gosh, look at my abs. Mm. I don't know how because I've ate like quite a lot of food. So I had my vaccine and I didn't faint. So that's a big win for everyone. Obviously, Dan had to like walk me there because I was kind of worried. Because, like, I don't know why, but for the longest time I've had like, I get faint and I've literally fainted before at hospitals and like injections and stuff but all my blood tests that i had years ago and my vaccines i've successfully completed without fainting which i think is a big win so that's something done that i've been meaning to get done for like such a long time to get my second jab um like because when i went to the walk-in that was literally right next to my house i was like two days off being able to get my second and then a few weeks had passed and i was just so busy and i was like i really need to get this done so fingers crossed i don't have to many side effects because last time I felt so ill so hopefully I'm all right this time because it's literally the weekend tomorrow so I've got work. We went to Morrison's. Which like obviously has really cool stuff but it's so expensive we have to be super super quick. Um, so I did catch out the corner of my eye because I'm literally obsessed and of course I saw this but they had like the cutest home section and they had like these old cat egg cups and then they just had like such cute home stuff I didn't really get to look though so I want to go to Morrison's to get home stuff if I can but I got some food which if you know me you know I'm literally obsessed with kinder <gasps> oh no what have I done to the box I'm obsessed with kinder so I've never seen these before, kinder cards. Have you ever seen these before, babe? And I literally got some sushi. Danny has copied my outfit for today. That's bullshit. I bought this hoodie and you told I me. I had it on us. Get us both in the camera. My arms aren't long enough. Okay. I had this on first and then you put it on. Yeah, but I bought this first. Why are you like anonymous, like not putting our faces in it? So I had this on first. And furthermore, 
I have like my thermal on. I was up earlier this morning than you. I had a job interview. I was up earlier. I was changed first and I had this hoodie laid out to put on afterwards. I had my thermal on. He has put... Wait, where is your thermal? I packed it because I'm going to change when I do the seminar. He's got the same thermal <coughs> as me that I got him for his birthday and then he's copied this as well. You probably saw this. Yes. I had to I buy that hoodie after I bought it because you wanted it too. Is that why? I, I thought it was just too small. Sure, have one. Actually, that size fit perfectly. Then we should put the hoods up mm. and do like a weird like, do like one of those dances, like you know on TikTok, like. But like at the same time because we both have like the little alien hood. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Have you, you copied? No. You haven't got the camera on me. Like I've noticed that you don't really put the camera on me. Mm. Are you jealous of me? Mm. I think you are. Mm. Why are you copying my outfit and stuff? You want to beat me, don't you? Everyone does. So we are heading off to <gasps> DM2. Danny, you're supposed to be my camera guy, my sound guy, my lighting guy, and Guess you just had Katy Perry teenage dream she was lost now on this. Well, I didn't know. Her. I also feel like one of those like camera guys on those like uh, TV shows. You know, on those like extreme TV shows where they're like driving down the mountain and shit. And they don't get any credit. They're just. <laughs> it's just my road. Yeah. <laughs> That's just what it is like. Oh. Do you want an electric car? Let me say that. Um, so we are heading to All Star today. I hate this angle of me. Like, I don't like. What is this? Oh, and that's nice. If I put any more in front of you, you just won't be able to drive it. It's actually not even in my vision, like that's fine. So we're heading to All Star today, it's Sunday. I have the worst stomach pains in the world. Like, I love being a girl, it's so fun. Have I mentioned that? But we're heading to All Star. I'm very excited because like, I just watched wrestling yesterday, but when you watch wrestling, it's so fun, but you just want to get in and do it yourself, so. It's because you watch me. Yesterday. Someone who's like, I don't want to be in the vlog, like, I'm not, like, some of us don't always want to be in front of the camera, like, we're not performers, like, here, yeah. you're there, like, oh, you want me to I don't want a mountain. I held back from doing my impression of you, and then there you are doing your impression of me. <laughs> I can't do an impression of you, which is weird. But let me do it, like, and you know, the thing is, is, you just want to wrestle because you saw me wrestle. <laughs> That's what you do. <laughs> Did you even listen to my impression of you? Yeah, why am I so like epic? That's how you talk. What epic? Well, yeah, just like everything's like, you know, you can be just telling me that like we've run out of milk. <laughs> it would be so intense. <laughs> but we are heading to All Star today. Where is it? Rocky Pool? Uh, Rocky Park. Rocky Park? Rocky Park. I've just made up a location. All the Americans on my Instagram are like, you're definitely making this place up. You're definitely. <laughs> this isn't a real place. But I, fuck, I just despise cyclists. I'm so sorry to all the cyclists out there, but it's just not okay. Like, get, why do you have to be in the middle of the road? You could be on the side. But we're heading to Rockley Park, not the pool. But it's, it's, in, it's in, in pool. pool. Yeah. But I've combined the words. So I've made like a thing that isn't real. But we're heading to Rockley Park to wrestle. It's like two hours and 15. We are going to go to MS to get those good gluten free options for me because we went to Tesco last time and they had nothing like not a singular thing i don't feel like they even have vegan i feel like they didn't they didn't much no oh, yeah i feel like they literally had nothing um i ended up getting some oats from costa but obviously yeah i just was kind of hungry it just wasn't really enough basically so we're going to MS to get something i've had a shake this morning so i've had like something but i want to eat a bit more and then because like, when you get there you do the ring and then you do your match afterwards you're just starving so it's really important to eat before um and i feel like obviously i'm trying to not have as much gluten at the moment because i've just been having way too much so i found like good gluten-free option we'll get there and like they won't have any that will be the situation like this as always i'm here like yeah no way no way around here i just i love anyway. it they've got what's that thing i have egg what's it called like the mushy egg that sounds vile. I think it was just called Eggman. Is that what it's called? Like, you know, the mushy egg. It's yeah. not like egg, egg. It's like a mushy egg. egg well, yeah. once when we were going to like, where did we used to train? Where was that barn? Is it in Plymouth? Or remember that? That's not right. Hmm? Ipswich. Not good. Um, <laughs> I got 
like the eggs you can get from the supermarket meal deal and I was eating one and I dropped a bit and we don't I think we ever found that did we where did the egg ever go it's meant to be <laughs> just like make the car stink of eggs <laughs> my car smells gorgeous by the way I will say that I bought like all stuff to like make it all cute like air fresheners and like this really nice linen thing that you like stick on the air then so it just constantly blows out like nice refreshing scents because when you have to give stinky people a lift it just always smells cute in here i feel personally attacked huh i feel personally attacked <laughs> i wasn't talking about you <laughs> yeah. but um yeah we're here now so i'm gonna go in get some gluten free and then we're gonna go drive we're early as always so that's fine but um <laughs> We're just always so early for these, but I feel like you'd rather be early than late. And I feel like when you're doing a journey that's like two hours, if you're like if you're late, you can be really, really late. It's not just like forty minutes and it adds like ten on it. Really out of time. So we're gonna go grab some food and wrestle. Danny, are you gonna get it at all? No, he's never the camera. I feel rubbish today. I look disgusting. The ladder match is taking a toll like a rubbish. Mm. 